Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are demanding a private christening for baby Archie, but do readers agree? Readers can vote in our poll on whether they believe the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are right to keep Archie's christening private. The tot, who is seventh in line to the throne, will be baptized at Windsor Castle on Saturday. Meghan and Harry are taking a different approach to Prince William and Kate. While the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge held the service behind closed doors for their three children, they let photographers take pictures of them arriving with their guests. Prince George and Prince Louis were christened at the Chapel Royal in London. Princess Charlotte's ceremony was held at the Church of St. Mary Magdalene in Sandringham and William and Kate invited members of the public to the paddock outside the churchyard to enjoy the occasion. But Meghan and Harry will only share selected snaps of Archie's christening a day later. The decision comes after it emerged taxpayers had coughed up £2.4 million for renovations to the Sussex's home Frogmore Cottage. Royal author Penny Junior branded the move a mistake. She told the Sunday Times, they can't have it both ways. Either they are totally private, pay for their own house and disappear out of view or play the game the way it is played. Seeing Archie and his godparents arriving at the christening is what people are interested in. It isn't bearing your baby's soul, just giving the public who love and support them a crumb to enjoy. Many people don't understand why they are paying nearly three million pounds for Harry and Meghan's house. So in terms of public relations it would be a good quid pro quo for the pair to briefly show Archie off. Since his arrival, the newest addition to the royal family has only been seen in a photo call which he slept through and in two Instagram pictures. One of the snaps showed just his feet, while another hit part of his face with Harry's hand. Majesty Magazine editor-in-chief Ingrid Seward warned Meghan and Harry that royal fans will be hoping to see a traditional snap of Archie's christening. She told the Daily Mail, I think what people want and what people are used to seeing are lovely family images of the baby in the royal hunnit and lace christening gown. They won't want an arty Instagram shot of Archie's foot three days later if it's left up to the couple themselves to take pictures and release them. The pictures they issue are so stylized. People just want to see Harry, Meghan, the baby and the gown and the godparents, that's all. It's traditional. But there's nothing wrong with a bit of traditional when it comes to a royal baby.